Hi, this is Joanne. I know I haven't uh, put up any video blogs in a while because I was thinking, oh, maybe I should fix myself up. Hair, makeup, nice outfit to do these blogs. But I'm kind of a realist. <laughs> and to me, this is what it is most days when I'm working. So unless I'm going out to weddings, funerals, parties, Really, I don't wear much makeup, hardly, well, none, most of the time, and this is it. I get up, I put my hair in a pony or a clip, and I've basically just woken up. It's now 8.14 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, and I've woken up at about 6.30, which is late for me, because normally I'm up between 4 and 5. And uh, I thought today maybe I'd talk about the importance of having your own space as a writer. Um... I've got two adult children still living with me and grandchildren that come to visit and sometimes sleep over. So all of the rooms are taken. I've been working at the kitchen table. Not optimal. Every time someone needs the table for dinner time or whatever, I have to clear out, get rid of my papers, my computer, everything. And that kind of puts a crimp in my plan. So, I've taken a small spot in my husband's man cave. This is the man cave. And here's my spot. Not bad. I've got uh, my printer, desk. There's a window in the basement here. There's a couple of windows. My calendar. I haven't decorated the walls yet. This just happened a couple days ago. A comfortable chair which is falling apart, but it's very comfortable. Better than the kitchen chair. And this is where I keep a lot of my work. I'm a very disorganized person, as you can see. So it's a mess, but I know where everything is. And I also have my books stored in here. And here. So, this is my office, and uh, the importance of having an office is that you can have time and space to yourself when you're working. Um, it's kind of important because you don't want to get off track hearing the noise of the rest of the house. It, I'm not really closed off here, but I am pretty private. So, uh, this is something you should do. Just find a little, even if you have a a small space like in an apartment or whatever try if you're serious about writing try and find yourself a small spot that you can block off just for yourself to have your personal things and you don't have to move them all the time like the, the tools you use as a writer you don't want to have to move things all the time every time someone needs the space so that's really important it it keeps and it also keeps you feeling like uh you know, your, this is your job and keeping your workspace separate from your home space, um, which I think is really important because, uh, because as writers we work alone, we often don't even feel like we have a job, but this is our work, so uh, treat it as such. Anyway, I'll be back uh, with another video blog uh, as soon as possible. <laughs> Take care.